Thank you so much, Tara. Today in the Southern Tier, another vote is taking place. Voting is now open for school board elections and budgets across the state. 18 News Corning Bureau Chief Ariel Salk joins us now live in Corning with a breakdown of that vote. Ariel, what are you seeing tonight? Good evening, Jordan. The voting booths open today at 11 a.m. and they will remain open until 8 tonight all across the southern tier. These budget votes might not draw out a crowd like a presidential election does, but the results make a direct impact on the local community. I spoke with one resident after she submitted her ballot. Because it's important, um, and I will have grandchildren in the school district, so it's important for our voices to be heard. Very easy. Just walk in, don't forget your mask, um, but just takes a few minutes, and that's it. I just, I think it's important that you get out and you vote. Yes or no, whether you're for the budget or not, it's important to get out there and do it. Budget proposals in the region range between 9.8 and 134.4 million dollars. And the budget, if it doesn't pass, will have to be revised and then vote again next month. One of the propositions here in Corning is to add several new school buses and a pickup truck to the fleet. Now, here in Corning, we aren't seeing a whole lot of people out here. I've seen a few trickle in and out, so come out and Make your voice heard and vote while you have the next few hours left. Reporting live in Corning, Arielle Salk, 18 News.